All right, so I wanted to take a minute and give you an update on the Piazza Cotton Cuts Mystery Quilt. This one is clue number one, and I've also gotten clue number two done as well, and I'll share the clue number two in just a minute. But this one is Diamo, and it is they small, and there are two of each of these. So the small has um, two sets. So this one is the clue number one, and then let me share clue number two. And this one is Diamo clue number two, and there is two for this one as well. I have learned that I do not like bias. I have found that that is worse than binding for me, um, but I'm learning to do these half square triangles a lot better and, um, and then trying to sew on the bias. So I know that they're not perfect, but I love them just the way that they are. So I just wanted to share with you and give you an update. This one, I am not doing a video sew along with this one because this one is the one that my sister-in-law and I are doing together. So I don't video record that one, but I just wanted to go ahead and hop on here today and show you what the two clues look like so far. So uh, we're excited about clue number three. Take care, bye. And there was one other thing that I wanted to share with you on clue number two for, um, the, for this mystery quilt. On the bottom here, you will see that these half, half square triangles, they're all in order here, here, and here. And then when you get down to this one, it is flipped. So there was a lot of discussion on the Facebook group about the change. So just kind of as a FYI, the pattern is correct. Just um, be on the lookout. I almost thought that I was going to have to have my friend Jack help me today, but got it done the right way, the, right, the way the pattern said. So thanks to Ian Off Kilter Quilter for letting me know in my question on Facebook that it was right. The pattern was correct. So just know that this one here is flipped like these here. Okay, now I'm going. <laughs> Bye.